Over the past four years, we have invested some 17 billion US dollars in INT, and the results are encouraging. Between 2017 and 2021, the number of startups in Hong Kong rose 68% to a record high of 3,755 this year. Venture capital investment increased from 9.2 billion Hong Kong dollars in 2017 to 9.9 .9 billion Hong Kong dollars in 2020. And the future looks even better thanks to the national 14 5 year plan. The plan not only supports Hong Kong's rise as an innovation and technology hub, but also backs our ambitions to develop Hong Kong as a regional IP trading center. Rest assured, that my government will do all we can to capitalize on the support of the 14 5 year plan in developing Hong Kong as a regional IP trading center. As mentioned to my policy address, the government will implement a series of initiatives to promote IP trading, including further promoting and developing the original grant patent system by building up the substantive examination capability of the intellectual property department exploring with the mainland authorities on broadening the scope of application of the Patent Cooperation Treaty to cover the original grant patent system and extending other major international IP treaties to Hong Kong. We will also strengthen our IP regime and industry talent while boosting IP promotion and collaboration beyond Hong Kong. Among others, we recently launched a public consultation on amendments to the copyright ordinance the target is to strengthen copyright protection in the digital environment to ensure that our copyright regime keeps up with international developments while meeting Hong Kong's social and economic needs.